It's September 26th, Sunday, football day. This is my coffee cup. This is me. Welcome to my world. The weather will be in the 70s today. It's going to be cooler. I always do that, you know that. Uh, it's going to be cooler, and uh, it's not going to be humid or warm. It's going to be a cool 70, so you might want to wear a light jacket or a, a sh uh, what do you call those things, a sh a shea. It starts on a nest, I don't know. Not a scarf, a shea or something. I don't know. Girls wear them. But anyway, how the heck you doing? We're not going to use the H-E-L-L -L word because it's Sunday. How the heck are you just doing out there? You don't live three times. You don't live two times. You only live once. I'm moving right along. We're within 12, 13 days of the Light the Night Walk. Tomorrow is a very important show I'd like you to listen to. Some of you out there have given me $5 already. I had a $100 donation from one of the horse owners at the track and also a neighbor. I really appreciate it. Uh, I'm going to match the $5 ones, and uh, I'll talk more about that tomorrow. But it's coming up within, within two weeks, okay? We need your help, all right? It's a big cause. It's a great cause. But we're not going to talk about that today because it's football day. I'm going to bring up my picks. I have them right here. We on Ron's World are 5-1 and one and our best bets are 2-0. and oh. We generally love to take the points because they give you the points. The bookies in Las Vegas and everyone, they usually win week after week after week because people try to beat the point spread. They give them to you. Why not take them? We're going to take the Detroit Lions again. It's like every week we love them. They're getting uh, 12 points, 11, 12 points in some places, and they're playing Minnesota at Minnesota, which we're not worried about. Grab those points. Both teams are about equal this year. Detroit is very improved after their 2-30 and 30 over the last two years. Okay? Our second pick of the day is Cleveland, getting 11 points. They're playing in Baltimore. Baltimore and Cleveland have equal records. Cleveland is another improved team. These used to be two really bad teams. They're very much improved, and the lines makers are still making the lines really high. So take the 11 points with Cleveland. And our best bet of the day, we're bucking the trend and going against it. We're going to lay the points, and we're going to lay them on the road. Pittsburgh Steelers, the best bet of the day at Tampa Bay, minus the two and a half points. So we got Cleveland plus 11, Detroit plus 12, and for the best bet, trying to go 3-0, and we're going to go with Pittsburgh Steelers minus 2.5 over Tampa. All right, good luck. Go out there and get them today. Please bet legally if you can online and uh, or go down to Delaware. I think they have sports booking, whatever you want to do. All right, we're not promoting illegal gambling on this show. Uh, here it is. I showed it to you earlier. I need a sip of coffee. Uh, I played the song Heroes at the beginning of the show. I just want to give a brief... I don't have a friend of the day or nothing today because it's a football edition. But I want to give you a quick thing about that song, why I picked that song this morning. Everybody looks at heroes to be Ryan Howard, Michael Vick, people, whoever their sports hero is that's making like $20 million a year. Athletes, entertainers, movie stars, they're heroes, they're heroes. I'm going to tell you who my heroes are, and I'm going to tell you why. I was in McDonald's the other day, and I don't really frequent those fast food places, but I grabbed a little Egg McMuffin or whatever that breakfast sandwich is called, and I looked at some of the people working in there, young females, working their butts off. I mean, rushing around and working so hard and showing up to work every day because they have children, they have families, and they want to do the right thing. They're not selling drugs in the corner. They're not doing illegal things. They're doing it the right way. They're going in there, and they know they're making a small paycheck. I don't even know if they get any kind of benefits. I, I don't know what they offer the fast food places, but I know they're making a very low pay scale. But they don't give up. They don't quit. They know that they have to do the right things. Family values and morals, they do the right thing. They keep coming in there and they keep working. You say to yourself, how can anybody do that? Make those hamburgers and a grill eight straight hours and with a 10-minute break and this and that. They're doing it because they're heroes. They're my heroes. They're, they're doing the right thing in life. That's very hard what they do. I admire those people. So the children will have what they need. So their families will have what they need, and they're doing it the right way. You guys are my heroes, okay? The entertainers, the movie stars, and all that's going to be put to the side. You guys are my heroes, and you're all my friends of the day. I don't even know your names anywhere out there. God bless you. And everyone, have a great day, okay? Good luck with the football.